Mama Bear friends. Janelle is back with some swag craft ideas to share with you. So we're gonna make these cute little decoration on these adapters. So, of course you need to have a couple of USB adapters. And we have so many of these in our homes. We get them all mixed up to the point where my 12 year old daughter, she puts her initials on hers. <laughs> AJ and then of course we're gonna need some glue sticks you know make sure you have a pack of glue sticks you're gonna need to have a glue gun mine is a, it's called the mini glue gun from art mines got it years ago from Michaels you're gonna also need a couple of diamond wraps bling diamond wraps you can get whatever color you want and this is bought from Dollar Tree and of course we're gonna need a scissors paper towel or paper napkin and then just to have like a tray to keep your glue gun in. I do have a ceramic glass tray, but I don't know where it is right now. And let's get started. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell notification so you can be notified of new videos posted every single Tuesday showing you really fun and cute, simple DIY crafting projects that you can make yourself at home to either sell or give away to that special loved one. So let's get to it. The way I usually decorate these these things, really quick, there's several different ways we can do it. You can actually put little dots with nail polish, but I like to bling all of my stuff out. So first you're gonna get your bling wrap, whatever color you decide to roll with. So this is a gold and wrap it around. You can either put it in the middle like so, like that, or you can put it on the end if you're gonna use this size bling wrap. You could put it on the end, this is really cute. So if you put it on the end, you need to, um, you could leave it like this, or you can add another row and, and uh, add another piece here. Or they also have the much wider roll. This is the one inch roll. They have the much wider roll sold at Dollar Tree. Um, this is the five by eight, as you can see, and this is the one inch. Now here's the difference in the in the width the uh, width. This see one is fat and one is thin. Okay, so I like this one for this purpose, so I don't have to double do this twice. So we're just gonna wrap it around like this. And then cut. Cut where it needs to be cut. And it's covered up nice and easy, and be sure to keep it on the edge. So I already have a strip cut, but it's the um, the silver one, the five by eight. So to measure this out, I already have a piece cut from earlier to show you the length that you need. Uh, if you have a measuring tape, go ahead and open that up. It's gonna be almost five inches is what you're gonna need to cut. Almost five inches. It stops right before the five. So if you can see that, Put it on the one inch and here's the four and it's almost to the five so i would say you need four and a half yeah yeah four and a half yeah that's how much you need four and a half okay so if you're good at measuring go ahead and cut four and a half but if you're not good at measuring you can just like i said take the roll wrap it around and you be the judge from there okay you could wrap it up that way okay so we're gonna go ahead and use the big the big piece and since you already have one cut you can just use the same thing to measure you don't have to go back to your measuring tape and I'm just gonna line this up there and I know where to cut okay make sure we line it up on the edge all right so I'm gonna cut right here four and a half inch it all right make sure it's lined up yep and it's lined up perfect perfect length there you have it okay so make sure your glue gun has its sticks ready oh this 
glue gun, it gets hot so quick. I'm gonna keep this close to me. These glue sticks remind me of cobwebs. Okay guys, really simple, easy, really simple, easy craft. Remember, you wanna keep it on the edge. Um, before you glue this on, you wanna rub this off with some rubbing alcohol. Put the alcohol on your paper towel and just rub it off. You wanna clean off any dust, any oil from our fingers, our bear cubs fingers touching it. So I'm gonna clean off all of them. I already squirt some alcohol on my napkin. Let's clean this one off. Since we have so much of these, we put like a little dot and the blue dot we know that belongs to my daughter, but she already put her name on it. <laughs> All right. Okay, now let's get to it. All right, so I'm going to squirt a piece of glue. And this glue drives very fast. wholesale bulk I get these from Amazon they come in like a pack of 12 or 14 for $2.99 I'll be sure to post the information below but what you can simply do is just cut off a piece of tissue paper if you have any tissue paper from some leftover uh, supplies from people giving you gifts this tissue paper also comes from Dollar Tree so you just cut off a piece of tissue paper mm -hmm. 
make it a little even so it doesn't look so torn. Okay, much better. Make it a little even. Even though when they unwrap it, they're gonna tear it up anyway. But you know, presentation, it's all about presentation is everything. Okay, so we got our tissue paper. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, and then we just wrap it up. You don't need to put any tape on it. You wanna make it as easy as possible for them to open it up. <laughs> there you go. And then we have these cute little gift box that I got a long time ago at Michael's. It was up in the front by the register. It used to have a bow on top, but you know, I have kids, my bear cubs, so they took the bow off. It was a cute little tiny bow that was on top. And then I also bought these cute little ornaments that go on top of the Christmas tree. It says, Mom! <laughs> I bought these about two years ago from Michael's. It was up by the front register when you're trying to check out. They always have a bunch of items that's up front so I bought these and I gave these away as gifts it was such a cute they went inside the subscription box that I used to run okay so let's get back to their craft okay so if you want to give it away as a gift simply stick it in the box it fits in there perfectly well cover it up we can take the size and if you can find this again at Michael's that'll be great and it'll have the nice little bow on top and there's a cute little DIY Christmas gift you can make and sell or you can make it for fun or give it away as a gift idea for others. This will make a cute gift for like coworkers, somebody in your office, Secret Santa. If they didn't really get any specifics on what they wanted on their list, you can definitely make this craft and this will be really cute for them to have. They don't sell these in stores. I've never seen them in stores, but you certainly can make this and as a gift idea for others or definitely sell this.